morning everyone. Today we're taking a field trip. We're going to the Rocket Museum in Huntsville, Alabama. We'll take a ride there and I've been told by countless people, I need to go check that out if I'm gonna be up here. So we're taking the van and we're gonna go over for a field trip. Size of the boosters, you don't realize how big that is until you're standing right here looking at it. That thing is huge. This is an engine, one engine of the Saturn V. Saturn F1 engine, look at this thing. It's an actual engine right there. You know, I didn't realize all that stuff existed on there. I thought it was just a thing that made fire come out. That's one intricate thing right here. <laughs> That's what you call an engine for thrust. be a mock-up of the lunar lander same size mock-up right here look at the little flag <laughs> that's funny Playing with your ham radios now, all your digital SDR and high performance computers. Let's take a trip back down memory lane at some of this vintage NASA space program at the NASA Space and Rocket Museum in Huntsville, Alabama. I'll take you on a little field trip, show you a little bit of stuff, but I encourage you to come here with your family and your kids and get the experience of this. Your uh, ham radios and your SDRs and digital cameras and tablets are fun but let's see what they did back in the day and what they had when they brought us to the moon. Holy cow. Look at the size of this thing. Whoa. How did they get this in here? Good question. My gosh. Look at all this stuff up here. What is this, like stage two here? Holy cow. This is how you steer that thing, look at this. Whoa. Look at 
at this. Look at all the wiring. Holy cow. Oh, I saw something online about this. This is the computers back in the day. Now I gotta go ahead and watch this video again. Saturn's brain, look at this. All the capat, wow, look at the, man. I can't even remember where I saw this. I might have saw it on YouTube on somebody else's channel, man, but look at that. That's what computers used to be. <laughs> This. You gotta look into this thing. These things are tiny. Wow. <clears throat> that is just incredible, this kind of stuff. Memory module. Memory module. Look at that. Whoa. a lot of solar panels. Skylab tank fragment. Mobile quarantine facility. So they throw you in there and make sure you don't have the space funk. Moon germs, space funk. We're gonna go into quarantine to see if I have any moon funk. Oh my gosh, this is like a trailer. It's like a 1960s Airstream, man. Look at that. A little sink. Of course, all old green stuff. Scrabble. In case you got bored when you had the moon funk, you could play Scrabble. So it took all of this rocket here to get that little tiny thing up right there. Yep. I mean, that is, wow, I've never, that was the actual gantry they walked in on. History is right there. See, this is what it looks like, right, right there. Little bridge. That's how they got up on there. Sputnik, a replica. What is this? Oh, Jupiter missile. Werner von Braun's desk. Yeah. Um, Was that his actual telephone? Probably. His house <laughs> Right, how are you? Is that what they broadcast the shuttle launch or the rocket launch on? Apollo spacesuit right here. That's the actual one, huh? Wow, that thing was in space, man. <laughs> Thank you. 
No, no, sorry. So my wife, I was teaching my wife the other day about the space station and what they, they have, and it was originally called Mir, and uh, now it's the International Space Station. That's a replica of it. That's what it looks like. Lunar Rover. With the antenna, look at that. <laughs> Is that the actual size? Wow. Oh, the wheels are mesh. I was wondering about that. I, guess I didn't know they were inflated tires. I thought they were inflated tires, I guess. No, not. piano wire. Piano wire. Look at that, man. I know it's not the actual one, but a replica. Avenger Missile System Tabletop Trainer. Look at this thing. I guess that's a trainer on how to launch a missile. These speakers, you only hear when you stand directly underneath them. Look at that. And then when you walk this way, you can't even hear it. It just shoots it straight down. That, I think that's interesting. 